Hey guys, how's it going? I'm Jordan B1409. We all want these special crates that are coming out, and it is quite difficult because everyone is trying to get them, and that means that you're going to die, and maybe you're going to miss out on some of them. But in this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can get a limited of these crates. So if you're new, guys, all I ask for you is to subscribe for more daily GTA 5 content. I upload daily GTA 5 videos, and if this video helps you, please go ahead and leave a like. Press the thumbs up button below the video; it's greatly appreciated. And without further ado, let's get started. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to search for a GTA 5 online session, it has to be a public one, and what you need to look out for is these lobbies where it tells you that there's a special crate inbound. Now, it, it can say any time, as long as it says that a special crate is going to drop in 3 hours, 5 hours, 10 hours, just around there, then it's confirmed that this special crate is set to drop in this lobby. Now once you see that a special crate is ready for this lobby, what you're going to do is film Pegasus and you want to get yourself a buzzard attack helicopter. This is because um, it, it locks onto people so you can kill them easily and it's just easier to get around the map because this special crate can drop anywhere. Now once you know that a special crate is ready to go in the lobby, what you need to do is activate a leg switch. As you can see there's someone already right at this special crate so there's no chance I'm going to get it from here. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn on a leg switch. This is going to like my connection and um, I'm going to have a link to these leg switches in the description. You can use Net Tools, UDP, Unicorn or you can even use Xlag. And as you can see, I've liked the lobby so that everyone in the lobby is being kicked out of it. I'm being separated from the whole lobby. Now, as you can see, everyone's completely left now. So I am now the only person in this lobby. Now if I wanted to, I could go and have my tea, I could go and have a nap, I could do whatever I want and I can still get this easily because I'm the only one in the lobby. So I'm going to pick this up now and as you can see I got $5,000, 5000 RP, a minigun, body armour and a Bobo t-shirt. Now I'm going to show you what this Bobo t-shirt looks like in just a few moments and I've only just realised watching this video back that I unlocked a Los Santos Bell t-shirt as well which I didn't even know about so I'm going to have to check that out as well. But the Bobo t-shirt as you can see looks very nice. It's Bobo in red and you've got like a monkey on it and it looks very nice and there's different t-shirts every day so make sure to um, do this every day to get the new tops. If you want I can cover each top that comes out. If you want that then just let me know in the comment section below. But this is a guaranteed way of getting these on these crates because you basically like in the game it doesn't affect them okay. This isn't game breaking because what it does is today all those people who are in that lobby with me stay in that lobby and I get disconnected from that lobby and put in my own lobby with that crate still there for me to pick up. So enjoy the video guys, this was how to get unlimited crates, all I ask for you is a simple like on the video if it helps you and to subscribe for more daily GTA 5 content. I'm I Jordan B1409, this was unlimited crates and I will see you guys in my next video.